And the world has been paying tribute to the victims of the nightclub massacre in Orlando. From Seoul to London, tens of thousands have gathered in cities across the globe for vigils to remember the 49 people killed in that horrific terror attack. Oh jung has more. People across the world are remembering the 49 victims of the fatal Orlando shooting. At the Stonewall Inn, an LGBT landmark in New York, people laid flowers and candles along with rainbow flags. It seems like was set out to, you know, make obviously a huge impact in this community, and, and he did, unfortunately. What we need, all need to do is we need to kind of rise up above this because you can't live in fear. In Germany, some 150 people, including LGBT community members and citizens, participated in an impromptu vigil outside the U.S. Embassy on Monday. I came here because what happened in the United States yesterday touched me very much. I wanted to show my support and my solidarity with the people and show that we are not indifferent. In Soho in central London, thousands gathered to hold a two-minute silence for the victims. Crowds held banners and flowers to show their solidarity with Orlando and its LGBT community in standing against terrorism. Similar vigils were held in Hong Kong, Sydney and Mexico City. We can't be with the families of the victims in the United States, but we wanted to go to the embassy to support them and attend a vigil, a vigil for these youngsters who were killed over there. Seoul was not an exception. Civic groups and an LGBT community held a candle vigil on Monday evening to show support for the victims and survivors as well as sexual minorities around the world. Around 400 citizens turned up at the vigil to pay condolences. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.